the next one would be on going back to the element deletion example. Um, how, how important is mesh density with element deletion, and, and if it's important, you know, are there any tips that you can share with that? Well, like all uh, fine element analysis, you're usually it's usually a good idea to do a mesh convergence study. Certainly, you can uh, have two cores of a mesh in in, in uh, element deletion runs, and 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 the answers may not be uh, very accurate. The finer the mesh, of course, the better the answer. Typically, what I do is uh, is I, I look at two different things in there. I look at the criteria I defined, whether it makes sense, but I also look at whether I need to refine the mesh to uh, to get a, a, a better answer. And again, that's just like any other fine element analysis. You, you have to look at your the size of your mesh and and the, uh, the refinement to come to grips with whether you have a, a good solution to the problem.